In this video, we'll be multiplying whole numbers by decimals. We'll review the distributive property. Here we have 6 times 6, which equals 36. The distributive property tells us that instead we could multiply 6 times 4 plus 2, which is another way of writing 6. And using our distributive property, we would multiply 6 times 4, and then add it to 6 times 2. We would have 6 times 4 plus 6 times 2. 6 times 4 is 24, and 6 times 2 is 12. If we add those together, we get 36. The same result as if we multiplied 6 times 6. We'll be using the distributive property to help us multiply decimals. We're going to multiply 5 times 4 and 72 hundredths. First, we'll decompose 4 and 72 hundredths into 4 plus 7 tenths plus 2 hundredths. Next, we're going to decompose 7 tenths and 2 hundredths. 7 tenths becomes 7 times 1 tenth, and 2 hundredths becomes 2 times 1 one hundredth. Now we're going to use the distributive property and multiply 5 times 4, and add it to 5 times 7, and 5 times 2. This gives us 20 plus 35 times 1 tenth, plus 10 times 1 one hundredth. Thirty-five times one-tenth becomes three and five-tenths, and ten times one one-hundredth becomes one-tenth. And now we're going to add these three values together. We'll line up our decimal points and add. Five-tenths plus one-tenth is six-tenth. We have three ones and two-tenths. Five times four and seventy-two-hundredths is twenty-three, and six tenths. Last week, Christina ran for a total of six hours at an average pace of five and two tenths miles per hour. How many miles did she run in total? We're multiplying six times five and two tenths. We'll begin by decomposing five and two tenths. That becomes five plus two tenths. And now we'll decompose two tenths. It becomes two times one tenth. Now we'll use a distributive property to multiply six times five and add it to six times two. Now we have thirty times twelve times one tenth. We'll multiply twelve times one tenth. And now we have 30 plus 1 and 2 tenths. Added together, we get 31 and 2 tenths. So 6 times 5 and 2 tenths miles per hour is equal to 31 and 2 tenths miles. And this is the end of our video about multiplying whole numbers by decimals.